everybody, welcome to the card of the day. I am on the road, so this is pre-taped, and uh, I can't quite get my Periscope to always work when I'm on the road, so I um, have them backed up, and uh, I'm in Chicago, having a great time in Chicago. And today we are looking at the Ace of Pentacles. Um, aces are always the beginning. They are always the start of something. Pentacles are coins or material things. Whenever we see an archway like this, it's hope. And if you look, um, it shows the path through and the mountains way far behind. And what that tells us is mountains are always goals and attainment. And it is saying it's a, it's a, you're on the right path, but it is pretty far away. So you're at the beginning, as you would think, with an ace also you have your lilies in the front lilies are purified desires okay so it's really sort of a spiritual start a spiritual beginning and uh so i usually get up and i do my morning papers which is i just kind of write three pages of emptying my brain out and i always come up with something different i was thinking about sometimes i get this horrible negative feeling in my chest and i could never um it's not exactly like when you have a broken heart, but I went and I said, I started writing and I said, somebody help me with this. And what I realized is, first of all, it's when I get insecure, when I get afraid of something, there's a particular guy I keep running into that I have a little crush on, like a high school girl and I can't stand it. And that feeling comes up when I immediately assume I'm not good enough for him or there's someone better or something like that. So I dug in and it's sort of the first part of a broken heart. Like, did you ever get that? You have that broken heart feeling where it's almost a physical feeling. You don't, you always wanna be careful when you have negative feelings like that. Cause I really believe they manifest and then that's why people have heart issues or um, you know, you really can affect the physical part of your body. So I went looking into it and I realized why would I already have a broken heart over someone I just met? That makes no sense. You know why? Because I'm moving into the future. I'm moving and creating a negative future that I don't need to. So here's what you gotta do. First of all, that's me. I gotta work on my own self-esteem. But we've gotta continually remind ourselves, I am aware and I am here. I talk a lot about this book, Toofty, that I'm reading and I'm gonna put more information about it on. Uh, as I talk to you guys, it's about manifesting stuff. And the place to start manifesting is I am aware and I am here. I am aware of myself in this present moment and I am aware that I'm here. And what that does, it takes you out of the future of worry, it takes you out of the past that is depression, and it puts you right here in this moment where you can clear your feelings and deal with it. So today, if you feel anxiety, if you feel negativity, if you're breaking your own heart like I do sometimes, you wanna go right into, I am aware, I am here. Okay, because in this moment, everything is okay. I am aware and I am here. All right, everybody, keep that depression and anxiety away by being in the moment. I will see you tomorrow. I am aware. I am here.